Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you've never been here before, I'm Kristen. So we're gonna do this look right here. It's just a plain, no makeup makeup look. So let's go ahead and get started. This is a look I like to do whenever I don't really have a lot of time to get ready or I just wanna not look tired for whatever thing I'm showing up to. So the first thing I'm gonna do is brush my eyebrows upwards. I like to start off with my eyebrows because when I do my eyebrows, I feel like I look put together without doing anything else at all. So if I don't have time to finish my makeup, at least my eyebrows are done. So I'm filling these in with this ColourPop Brow um, Pomade. It's in the color Take Me For Granted. And first I just do the bottom part of my eyebrow, then I go to the top, and then after that I fill all of that area in. I leave a little bit in the front, and after I'm done filling them in, I go into the front and then I just do little strokes up just so it's a little bit lighter in the front. Then I go ahead and brush them back up and make sure I filled everything in. Next, to set my brows in place, I'm gonna use my ColourPop Brow Boss Gel, and I'm just gonna go in a sweep motion and go up with my brows. To clean up my brows, I'm going to use my Age Rewind Concealer, and I'm going in with a tiny brush and just cleaning them up. Since I'm not going in with any really colorful shadows today, I'm going to go ahead and also bring that concealer down to my lids because I don't need whatever shades I'm using to really like stand out today. So I'm just going to pull it all the way down to my lid. With my brows done, I already look a little less tired, see? So going in with my ColourPop No Filter Foundation, I'm just gonna go ahead and apply that all over my face. This is not the norm for me. I usually do not apply my foundation before I do my eyeshadow, but since I'm not doing anything crazy with my eyeshadow, there's no need for me to apply my foundation afterwards. And this is something that I do when I don't really have a ton of time. So I wanna do my foundation because if I can't do anything after I do my foundation, I won't look crazy but if I just leave the house with just eyeshadow on no foundation I feel like I look crazy so this is why I do my foundation first when I'm doing my no makeup makeup look So then after that, I'm going back in with this Age Rewind Concealer and I'm just gonna conceal underneath my eyes because like I said, I wanna just not look tired before I leave the house. So I'm gonna go in with my concealer um, underneath my eyes, on my forehead, my chin, and on the bridge of my nose. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and blend all of that out. Next, I'm going to go in and set my under eyes with my no filter concealer from ColourPop. This is in the color medium dark. I'm just going to go ahead and press that into this wet um, concealer. You want it to be wet so it sticks to it so that it can get into those creases and you don't have creasy under eyes later. So now I'm going in with this color called Sea Stars from ColourPop and I'm just going to place that all over my lid. It's just a neutral color for me so whatever color that you have that's neutral for you just place that on your lid and you'll be good to go. The next thing I'm going to do is take this shade called Cloud 9 from ColourPop and I'm going to go ahead and run that all in my crease. And just to give my, it's just to give my crease a little bit more depth so it just doesn't look like I don't know I feel like my face is all like one color right now so <laughs> I'm just giving a little bit more depth so that it doesn't look like it's one color 
going with my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in Deepest Dark, I'm just going to go ahead and dust away all that excess powder and then set all the other areas of my face. To bring some color back into my face, I'm going to use this Morphe Bronzer. It's a bronzer contour type hybrid thing so I'm just going to do that all over my forehead just to bring some color back and in my cheekbones and then I'm going to um, contour my nose a little bit with the contour side. I'm going in with my Urban Decay All Nighter Spray and I'm just going to set my face with it. And then I'm going to go in with my Hyper Real Glow from MAC. I'm going to go in with this color right here and I'm going to highlight all the high points of my face just enough. I'm not going to go crazy. Just I just want a little glow. Using my Bad Gal Bang Mascara from Benefit, I'm just going to go ahead and do my lashes. I'm doing top and bottom lashes. Here I'm just taking that highlighter shade and highlighting the inner corner of my eye. It makes you look more awake when you do that. For my lips, I'm using ColourPop Accelery in the color Hennyways. It's the ultra matte lip. And then on top of that, I'm going to apply my Urban Decay Hi-Fi lip gloss in the color Shadow Heart because I'm just obsessed with this combination right now. I'm just going to give my face one more good spritz just to make sure my makeup stays in place. Obviously I have to throw on a little bit more highlighter. I don't know what's wrong with me. I just like highlighter. For this look guys, this is how I achieve my no makeup makeup look. This is how I go from tired mommy to awake mommy. So I hope that you guys learned something from this and it can help you out in the future. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. Also, this is what I normally look like. My hair is never down. It's too big. <laughs>